hello you guys this is Pio here and I'm here today to share a journal which I made for my darling friend Sylvia so I wanted to try mixed media for the journal cover because she is the queen of um, mixed media art so some handmade flowers some gesso some acrylics and some twines with a bit of fabric washi and uh, i think that's it some book note paper some tissue papers some mod podge and what else some chipboard coloring and all that and that's how beautiful the uh, journal cover is i'm absolutely in love with the result and that's a single signature just a bakery twine to hold the pages together i would give a quick uh, flip so here I've created a pocket and then I've added a lot of goodies in here for her and uh, I did cover the uh, you know the base of this side with a uh, pattern paper because it was plain and I didn't want it to be plain and this is some uh, magazine paper that I've used some note paper for her to use uh, some pattern paper again because the uh, magazine paper was too flimsy and I didn't want it to be like that so to give a little bit of thickness I glued on a pattern paper uh, to it some washi some stickers and yeah that's a grid paper some stamping so it's basically I just did what my heart wanted to do there are no hard and fast rules here just stapled uh, a butterfly with my dear darling friend Jaya now she had sent my way some note paper, some doilies, it's a pocket here, some goodies in here, one more doily and um, yeah, some stamping, washi, magazine paper, stickers, oh my god, I absolutely adore this page, the cycle, it always reminds me, you know, to pedal my worries out. I'll, I'm, I'm totally obsessed with this idea of uh, stapling the punches to the corner of the pages. I mean, they just absolutely look so pretty from the side. And some stamping. She loves owls a lot, so I just wanted to add some team, th uh, owls. And um, this is a cutout from the Daphne's diary, which my dear darling Mona had sent me. So it's basically I have decorated the page, uh, the pages a bit for her and now it's her um, free will to kind of decorate it all the more. So it's basically got a lot of book note paper, magazine paper, story books, papers, children's books. I mean that's how I generally make my um, junk journal. So there is no scope for much writing in here. It's basically about... Um, chucking in things and maybe you can just stick a note paper on top of this decorate and embellish it a little bit and then jot down memories so basically it is not a writing journal here are a bit of stories you can write you can document your own life in there so this is a coat or a cutout which my darling terry had sent my way and i had to put it in there i adore these washies oh my god they are to die for so that's how simple the page is nothing spectacular or nothing kind of pretty much outstanding to some goodies in here for her some magazine cutouts and all that and that's a cutout from the magazine again and some stamping it's from the stamps that sylvia herself had given me and some stenciling i adore this paper clip that i made and that's how simple the journal is now if she wants she can add a pocket here and then add some uh, things uh, for her to use to play around with the journal if she's taking it out somewhere so i have actually decorated a lot of it for her and at the same time there's a little bit of room if she wants to do it by herself hope you guys are having a creative day and thanks a ton for watching love you so much bye bye